Now, I've got to say, I was a little disappointed that nobody gave me a heads up that I was going to be one of the stars of this man's Halloween special. Kind of got my feelings hurt like y'all just wanted to show me without telling me. But let's see. This is going to get exciting. It's almost comical. But, you know, we should all know when it's going to be trick or treat. So let's go start with the tricks. Watch this, y'all. Thank you for calling the Crown Plaza Chicago. If you think Little Me Avenue, Claw Avenue, Scrape Drop, Chloe, that look, I show y'all YouTube Chloe on the footage. Why ain't them other you? Now, do you really believe that, that you were showing me on the footage? Or was it just them screenshots that you stole and put them there and claimed it to be me? People got to learn the difference because that's his tricks. You know, the courteous thing when you're going to play trick or treat is to let the other person know not necessarily that you're pulling tricks but at least let them know if you plan on them being one of the stars of your show beings that you need so much help with your show is what i'm getting out of it but you ain't got no content that's why you keep doing this and pulling other people in your video because your videos, you have no content. YouTube is talking about that. I showed you Chloe on the footage and she a YouTuber. And she trying to desperately get him so they could defend her. Now, don't y'all remember when the lady called Scrape Drop? Did I just understand you correctly? I need somebody to defend me? Nah. I've been standing on my two feet by myself all my life. Now, if others choose to speak on my behalf against foolery, that's their God-given right. And it sure is funny how you refer to me as a YouTuber when I'm the one that was on Facebook for many, many years before you, while you were on YouTube. I mean, you, you do realize that you are on YouTube right now, right? That's where you're at with your multiple channels. Minus the ones that YouTube took away from you anyway. She told you about the order. And she gave you names. Now let's see you do it make sense now. Oh, now I'm in a vehicle now. That's what I'm asking you. Is it $200 if I lose it in my vehicle? No, it's 150 for a vehicle. How long you work here, sir? Quick, I need you to take up a screen and listen to everything that I'm telling you and pay attention, please. Do you remember that video by Kasha Tick? That he called the girl and said everything that happened. Do you remember Kasha Tick? Yeah, the dude from New York. Okay, look. It never crossed y'all's minds. Why would that man call that lady out of the blue? Tick. No. Rem okay, look up the video. How you spell it? Kasha Tick. Kasha Tick. C-A-S-H-A-T-I-K. That's a crew. It's Avenue Cartel. That's the name of the crew. And bro -Nem. Even back then, I found it funny that why would a stranger call another stranger who's supposed to have clues on this case? It was fake. Reached out to the security guard. I scared him so that they could go against each other, showing him all the pictures. And he's the one that's Francis Cave that ended up writing to Trey Gang. I guess everybody forgot how truth for reality put 
Trey Gang's on blast for the lies that he was telling. Are y'all trying to say truth for reality is a liar too? Truth for reality showed everybody how it was a fake comment written to himself. He forgot to log out. Page and Avenue Little Mink. The ones that killed her was GDK, Tolliver, Cashatick, and Avenue Cartel. If you look at everybody, you'll find everybody's connected, along with G Herbo, Official Glow Twins. Now y'all heard it. I need y'all to share the video. She exposed in the avenue. That's why Avenue Clark coming hard on me. Is that why you're switching Clark's name up to try to make him connected to somebody who's not even connected to the hotel? Okay. And hell of a chick too. They teaming up because I'm exposing the Masonic ritual what happened at the pod the reason why they said that's not little meat because little meat was a part of the branch of the masonry they you sound like a whole lot of somebody else that's a youtuber talking about masonic this and numbers that now since everybody loves to talk about tea so much how about we just have us a good old-fashioned Boston Tea Party, old-school style? I've had many people ask me why I'm not making videos when the information was given to me. Well, there's a lot of things that go into consideration, not just researching that just one person. It's researching where other info related to that person comes into play and how would they know this information so let's have us a little tea party now y'all hear great y'all trying to cut it off i already got up i already got up oh no y'all oh no them lights ain't getting up oh no i can't spill tea like this always worried about the numbers That hey, hey, up. hey, can I, can I ask you something? Yes. Um, the big bin in the bottom, you remember when, when they were going into the, um, the bathroom? See, now I'm going into this one. There's, there's the freezer. Watch, I open it. I don't know if I open that one or the other one. When you see the management and everything, his cousin is Avenue Little Meek. Kathy, and on the, this side of the, on the, where I pull this side, on the back side of that, there's a white thing you just push like this. It's a big button. Yes, a big white button. A big white button. You can't miss it. When I tell you I know how to find people, I know how to find people. Now that YouTube has a whole new category of defamation of, cat, of character, I guess he's going to find some new strikes on his channel. Because you're straight up lying about people saying that they're at a hotel. And the only reason why you have to be lying is because you have no content. Y'all think I'm playing? Let's find out. He has no content. He has no content to the point that he's coming to my channel and begging my viewers for content. I'm sure y'all don't believe it. I didn't see it. He had me blocked some kind of way. YouTube took care of that. The other day I put out a video saying that I backed up and supported Hell of a Chick and Clark Avenue in what they were saying in their video about the housekeeper. Then I started getting these comments. Wasn't making any sense to me. Because old boy found a way, and I say old boy as in player games, that he found a way to hack into YouTube system to block me where I couldn't see that he had commented. Don't believe me? It says right here. Make it bigger so y'all can see it. Right here. 
She says, I see Trey Gang over here poaching off your subs, asking for stuff to be sent to him. The nerve. That was two days ago. I says, wow, you're the first to tell me. She says, well, now you know 100% he's coming over to your channel and poaching in the bushes, sneak like the sl slithery snake he is. Now, thank you, Tracy. Because if she would not have come back and said this comment here that I saw today, I would not have even taken it any further. I would have thought that the other lady meant that she saw something from his channel. And she said, Tracy says, well, he's right here in the comments, and that takes nerve because, hey, Trey knows everything, so why is he here? What did I say? An hour ago. I don't see him. She says he's under. Wow, wow. He's under some... One's comment, sorry, I'm running late for work. Under Jennifer Rebecca post below. I still didn't see him at the time. You see, he must have seen these people commenting on my video. So he got himself all in a wad. Because see, it's already been two, three days back. I don't got nothing to hide. Payao. I see him now. Thank you. Two days ago. Thank you. I got his card. Or So what does he do? The coward that he is. Three days ago, she had commented. Two days ago, he came back and saw it. Which is why one day ago, he came back talking crap about her. in his video. He still got me blocked off. See that? Watch this. Hi, y'all. If I don't get 200 likes on this post, because I'm all about the numbers, two days ago, imagine that. You're putting your life in danger? <laughs> Whatever. But I tell you what. I think I'm going to hit this kid up. Let them know what you are doing. Do you know how old that is? I seen that like three years ago. With still only 39 supporters. Beginning in December 2017. See?
You're trying hard, Trey Gang, ain't you? You in that desperate need of attention. So now, when you sit and you think that people aren't as smart as they really are, you might want to think again. August the 23rd of 2018 at 11.23 a.m. is when I uploaded this entire video to my Google Photos. What do you think that is? What do you think it's not? Boston tea. Did he just say something about some Boston tea? Did you hear his voice? Let's go bigger. Boston T. Sounds like he's still in puberty. Sounds nothing like the housekeeper. Hey, oh. Yo, Chip, hey, what you on, Shorty? <laughs> These hoes are here tripping. <laughs> We all still game, baby. Y'all know I rock DDK for now. You see, the one thing about me, I won't ever run out of content. Right there. You see how low my marker is down here? This is just my videos folder on Google Photo. And you see it is from 2018 in August. I pull all the way down still. Go some more. We can go all the way up. I won't run out of content. I don't have to make up lies about others. I have lots and lots and lots of proof. From this case alone. Watch this. This is how you handle it when you've got so much content. You let them handle it for you. Hey, Sin Sin. Do I need to go on more? So now you were able to have your little trick on my channel and I get to have a little treat on research on other people's channels or in the Facebook groups. Go straight to the sources. <laughs> 